are you serious? Are you serious? Can we read from the book of Psalms? Because <laughs> this is one of my favorite books in the Bible, really. I love the whole Bible. But there's days you just want to read from Psalms. And so here's what it says. Psalms chapter 1. Blessed is a man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful. But his delight is in the law of the Lord, and in his law doth he meditate day and night. He is like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruit in his season, and his leaf also shall not wither, and whatsoever he doeth shall prosper. The ungodly are not so, but are like the chaff which the wind driveth away, therefore the ungodly shall not stand in the judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of the righteous. For the Lord knoweth the way of the righteous, but the way of the ungodly shall perish. You know, we, we can be blessed. And I love Psalms 3. Look at this. Lord, how, how are they increased that trouble me? Many are they that rise up against me. Many there be which say of my soul, there is no help for him in God. But thou, Lord, art a shield for me. You're my glory and the lifter of my head. I cried unto the Lord with my voice, and he heard me out of his holy hill. I lay me down and slept, and I awakened for the Lord sustain me. I will not be afraid of ten thousands of people that have set themselves against me round about. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all my enemies upon the cheekbone, and thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Salvation belongeth unto the Lord, thy blessing is upon thy people. Well, praise the Lord. I'm telling you, just receive the blessed, precious promises of the word of the Lord, and you will be blessed. I want to read to you a letter we got. You know, we get letters every day now that come in, people getting saved, people getting healed. This one is from Nigeria. All right. This one came in from Nigeria, came into our home church. And, uh, Here's what it says, and I just, I've been rejoicing ever since. Uh, Dear brethren, in our Lord Jesus Christ, the grace and peace of Christ be with your precious ministries. One of your biblical leaflets that were shared in our school has touched and changed the lives of 90 brothers and sisters. Some evangelists came to our school last year and distributed different types of tracts and leaflets and booklets to students. After so many months of memorizing the content in the leaflet and been, that was given to us, we realized that we are all lost sinners and only Jesus can save. So today, only 90 of us dedicated to give our lives to Christ Jesus is now our Lord and Savior. Praise God. We have now started going to church uh, we have we have now started stated going to church, departing from sins, telling others about Jesus. But our main problem now is just that the 90 of us don't have a Bible to read God's word and continue in our newfound faith and also use our Bibles at hand to preach Christ to other lost souls, brother. That is why we decided to write you in this way and to request 90 Bibles for our daily and spiritual growth. Dear brother in the Lord, time cannot permit me. I could have listed all the names of the 90 brothers and sisters, but however, we seriously need your help um, for 90 Bibles because we all don't have them. Please kindly send us 90 Bibles, complete, holy Bibles. Uh, we... All are praying for your ministry. Love, Sister Patricia. Um, this is just amazing. You know, we get letters like this all the time. We'll be sending Bibles in the mail 
to them today and get them headed. And here was the thing about this. This letter just arrived at our home church this past week. And it was dated 27th of, of December, 2014. It took it three months to get here in the mail. Uh, but it made it. Praise God. And there were 90 people saved. As some of our... Well, we've been sending Bibles to Nigeria already. So, uh, and, and when we do, we always send other material with it and CD sermons with it, stuff like that, to help minister to people out there. And so we're just, we're so thankful. The Lord said he would bless his people. And I just want to say thank you to all of you who've, you know, I hardly ever say this on YouTube. I do it all on my live show. We, But I just want to thank you guys for, uh, first of all, all my subscribers 86,000 of you, whoever, however many you are. And just Sunday, we just went over the 50 million views. We've had 50 million views of our videos, which is an incredible number. But I mostly want to thank you for supporting us, for your prayers, for your faithfulness, for your kind words, for your, for your love, and for your financial support. That is why we're able to send Bibles all over the world every week to individuals for free, pay the postage, and send prayer cloths that we anoint and pray over to the sick. Uh, we just thank you because without you, we couldn't do it. But with Christ, we can do all things through, through Christ that strengthens us. So God bless you and thank you. Praise the Lord for these 90 souls in Jesus' name.